for the uh -huh. bigger events, but really doing anything outside is just going to be dealing with the heat. Yeah, and for those of us at Garth, the whole thing is outside That's at right. Paul Brown Stadium. And it's going to be hot. <laughs> uh, Raven Richard brings us the answer this morning. How do we get used to this heat, Raven? Oh, hey, good morning. Hey, good, good job bringing Garth in there. So, okay, first let's talk about acclimatization. It's a process the body goes through to adjust to the current climate. So it takes about two weeks of exposure for the body to feel used to whatever temperature changes are happening at the moment. It's not the same length of time for everyone. According to the Centers for Disease Control, factors such as body fat, age, physical conditions, and even medication can impact how fast your body adjusts. I asked Dr. Christian Gosvik, a physician from the Christ Hospital Net Health Network, if there's anything else the sudden rise in temperatures could do to our bodies. Flare ups of COPD for folks with um, respiratory and lung diseases, um, the hotter temperatures, the higher pollen counts, those sorts of things bring along um, a lot of strain on the respiratory system, especially for folks who are already having problems. Um, so we see a big uh, kind of spike in those issues with these rapid swings in temperature. And Dr. Gosvik also mentioned the temperature changes can impact your sinuses as well. The CDC suggests gradually increasing your time outdoors, start off slow and then gradually build from there, guys. Yeah, if you can, Raven, so many people work outside.